Christmas in Italy is all about the light shows, religious traditions, and decadent shopping. The Eternal City is one of the best cities to experience festive Italian flair during the holidays. The city is transformed with Christmas markets, light displays, and various festive opportunities to enjoy the season around town. I'm Angel Castellanos for the Tour Guide, and today we're discussing how to get into the festive spirit right here in Rome. I'll show you what to see in Rome during the holidays, where the best Christmas markets are, and how to enjoy this special time in the city. Christmas is an exciting time to visit Rome, so if you can't visit Christmas in Rome this year, or simply wonder what Christmas is really like in Rome, this episode is dedicated to everything Christmas in the Eternal City. The Christmas season is a distinctive time in Italy and is closely associated with Rome. Let's not forget, the capital of the Western world during the first Christmas 2,000 years ago was in Rome. Today, the ancient capital is still a leading city in the Christian world with some of the most sacred Christmas traditions in Europe. So let's get started with a little Christmas story. St. Francis is credited with building the first ever nativity scene in 1223. St. Francis was a medieval monk who was a humanist, environmentalist, and a master teacher of Bible lessons. Since most of the population was illiterate during this time, he was permitted by the Pope to physically build the story of the birth of Jesus with clever props. St. Francis was a brilliant storyteller and included elements from all of the gospel stories and used live animals to build a manger in a cave about 100 kilometers north of Rome. This creative storytelling helped local people connect with the story of the nativity and the Christmas message in a vivid way. Even miracles were associated with the first manger scene built by St. Francis. 800 years later, the tool to teach people used by St. Francis about the first Christmas can be seen all over Rome. The nativity scenes we see today are often placed in local villages or in city centers just the way St. Francis did. To better understand the birth of Christ, instead of Bethlehem, the manger is in an area local Italians would recognize. And that, my friends, is Interessante. The domes and obelisks that mark ancient relics and sacred stops can be found all over Rome and interlace the city together. There are countless of churches in Rome, so you of course can't see them all. But the most famous stop is the tomb of St. Peter, upon which a great basilica has been built, topped with Michelangelo's incredible dome. Vatican City, which is the headquarters of the Roman Catholic Church, is an unmissable destination in Rome. If you haven't visited, I definitely recommend a guide and booking a skip the line tour. When I'm in Rome, I feel like just one pilgrim in a long tradition of people who've traveled here for centuries. An unmissable tradition in Italy is the creative manger scenes on display. You will find presepi, as manger scenes are called in Italy, in different sizes all over Rome. Some of them are inside of churches or in the windows of shops and bakeries. The grandest and most exciting of all nativity scenes in Rome is in St. Peter's Square, where the Pope celebrates Midnight Mass every Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve Mass at St. Peter's Basilica is the hottest ticket in town and the most popular place for worship. If you'd like to book a seat for the inside of the Basilica, you have to do it well in advance. These tickets are very hard to come by. People from all over the world come together to worship and hear the Pope's message. You can also return to St. Peter's on Christmas Day at noon when the Pope gives his Christmas Day Urbi et Orbi speech and blesses the crowd in St. Peter's Square. He only does this on Christmas and Easter, so expect large crowds. If you're looking for fewer people, head to the Basilica of Santa Maria Maggiore, one of Rome's oldest and most important churches. Faithful Catholics believe that the original planks from the crib of Jesus Christ are inside of this church. Christmas is a time when families, friends, and romantic couples get together for another reason to head out for a passeggiata along one of Rome's many famous thoroughfares decked out with holiday decorations. There are plenty of places throughout the city for locals and visitors to get into the holiday spirit. 
Via del Corso, or Via dei Condotti, are famous shopping streets that are fun to see at this time of year for their never-ending Christmas lights. If you want to step up your shopping game, head to Via del Babuino for a locals-only spot. Christmas markets pop up all around the city where you can purchase unique handcrafted gifts. One of the most popular Christmas markets in Rome is in the iconic Piazza Navona. It's also known as the Befana Christmas Market and is scheduled to open on December 1st, running to January 6th. As street vendors line busy squares like this, the best place to keep yourself warm is next to the chestnut cellar. The festive surroundings, the aroma, and popping sound of chestnuts means that Christmas is around the corner. A good walking route to get into the holiday spirit is to start at Piazza Venezia to check out their giant Christmas tree. Then head down to Via del Corso to the pedestrian-only Piazza del Popolo. If you can't make it all the way down to Piazza del Popolo, you can always turn up Via Condotti, where you can end up at the Spanish Steps. You've heard enough of what I think of Christmas in Rome, so now let's hear from our local Roman friends. Ciao, my name is Nida and I am a purchasing manager. Hi, my name is Femke and I am one of the tour guide's product specialists. What does Christmas mean to you? Christmas for me is being with people that I really care about, friends, family, preparing for the holidays and since we're in Italy it's all about the food. Christmas to me definitely means spending time with your friends and family and having a very good excuse to eat lots of delicious food. What is your favorite Christmas pastime? My favorite Christmas pastime is actually putting up our massive Christmas tree inside of the house, always whilst watching The Grinch. And uh, in the meantime of doing that, of course, we have our lovely pets around. <laughs> what is your favorite thing to eat during Christmas time? In Italy, of course, we have lots of food during the holiday season, especially for Christmas lunch. Everything is delicious, but nothing beats Nona's homemade tortellini, especially if you have a grandma from Bologna. What is your favorite place to visit in Rome during Christmas? Everywhere is stunning during the season in Rome, but my favorite part is the one from Piazza Venezia to Piazza del Popolo, so Via del Corso, basically. I'd have to say St. Peter's Square. There you will find the biggest, sparkliest Christmas tree of all, and usually in front of the Christmas tree, they build a very big nativity scene, which allows for amazing pictures. Definitely if you visit at night, you have the beautiful lights of the Vatican in the background with the tree in the front, it is Christmas all over. Thank you so much for getting into the holiday spirit with me. Don't forget to hit that like button. If you love it, subscribe and hit that bell so you can find our next video. I'm Angel Castellanos for the Tour Guide. Happy holidays and Buon Natale!